Hi, George here, and I want to introduce you to my new Photoshop Elements 2024 course. Now, I know this channel is now all about gaming, but most of my subscribers for my Photoshop Elements content are still here on this channel. They haven't moved over to my new HTG Photo channel yet. So this is for everybody who either hasn't seen my new HTG Photo channel yet, or who is still here and just hasn't made that move yet. I have my brand new course here for Photoshop Elements 2024. And this covers the whole program in great detail on how to work with this and is perfect for beginners. This course is actually going live on March 29th. And for a very limited time right now, you can get this course at $10 off on a pre-sale. I'll put a link for that down there in the description. But let me take you through this course and show you what this actually does. First off, this is video training, very similar to YouTube, although the way I cover things is different than I do over on YouTube. With my YouTube videos, everything is a project video. I just work through the whole project and show you step-by-step -step on doing each one of the projects. My training is totally different. In the training, I go through and show you how to use the program and I explain every single process in the whole program. It's all done with video training, as you can see right here. Here's module one, and the main video is right here. Now, since Photoshop Elements 2024 has a brand new interface, it has a new look, the icons have changed a little bit. You can have the light and the dark mode, some of those things. Because of that, this whole training here is brand new, all brand new videos. Normally on my training, I'll go in and each year I'll update the things that have changed. I'll take out things that are no longer there. And just kind of update the existing training. For 2024, everything here is brand new, all brand new videos demonstrated here in version 2024. In the training course, I go through the whole program here, including the organizer. Let's take a fast look at the organizer. Here we go. I cover everything, how to use the organizer, how to filter by different media types, how to use the create options, how to check for people, places, events, using the search, everything on the right-hand side about working with tags and information, how to use all the menus up here. We cover everything on that, covering all the different methods on finding images in here, working with albums and working with folders, how to import new images, everything, everything across the bottom, all of that is covered inside the training. Let's go back over to the editor right here. And in the editor, I cover all the tools, left-hand side in great detail. I cover all the three modes, the quick mode, including the new quick actions right down here. Cover the guided mode, of course, and all the new features in here, such as the add text. Cover the advanced mode. This used to be called expert, it's now called advanced. And I show you how to do everything in here, including working with your layers, most important. And of course, I cover everything in all the menus, including a look at all the different filters in here, all the selection tools, including the new background and sky selections, how to use all the different enhanced features. Everything is covered in this new training course. Now you have full controls for the videos. Right down here is a full screen button. Click on that, and this will then play full screen. Click on the button again, it goes back to the regular screen. Each module, over here on the right hand side has multiple videos in it. Here's the videos for module one. And simply click on a thumbnail to switch over to that video. Now along with the full screen button, if you click into the video area, it's going to be playing. I can then pause that right here. You have your volume control right here, slider control down the middle. And you even have right here, adjustments for the resolution and the playback speed. If you want to, you can actually slow down the video right here or go faster, it's up to you. Click the gear icon again and that goes away. And then once the video is playing, this little menu bar will go away in just a moment. There it is. You can bring it back up again just by rolling over the video. I've broken the training down into several sections, starting off with just a basic intro and tour, showing you the whole program very quickly. Everything is and how to access the different parts of the program. I then have a longer discussion in two modules here on how to use the organizer, which I rarely talk about over on YouTube. And then take a look at the editor, with quick guided and a bit more here on the guided photo merge, the advanced section, new features, tools, panels, going through the whole program in here and showing you in detail how everything works. I then go into doing some projects, but they're different than the way I do projects over on YouTube. We'll come down here to the remove change background module, load that up, here we go. And you can see, instead of just doing a project, I have several videos in here which tell you how to use all the different tools that will be used in the project. And I go into great depth on the tools. Once we understand all the tools, I then finish off this module with the actual project here. So you're not having to guess how anything is done. You have all the information you need in this series of videos for the final project, which makes this training perfect for beginners. So this is the best way to learn for a beginner. Now, 
Along with this, I also have up here project files. Click on that. And here we go. It's a few things in here that are important. First off, I have a printable list of keyword shortcuts right here. There's a printable outline for the whole training right here. So you can print it out. And the outline includes video lengths and times. So you know exactly what's going on and how long the videos are going to be. And then I have images that I've used in the training, plus more images, things I've used on YouTube as well. So all of that is in here. And then every single project in the training has a downloadable file giving you the complete Photoshop Elements file that I used when I was making that project. So you have all that information available very quickly and easily in here. Let's go back here to the intro again. And as I mentioned at the beginning, for just the next couple of weeks or so, I'm having this on sale. I'm doing the official launch on March 29th. This whole thing goes live at that point. And on March 29th, the price goes to my regular price. Right now though, you can get this for $10 off, which is about 25% off. And I'll put that link right down there in the description. So if you wanna get my new training here for Photoshop Elements 2024, now is the only time that you can get this for $10 off. Once it goes to the regular price, I'm not gonna be changing that again. So today is the best time to go ahead and grab this before the price goes up to its regular price. And since we're here on YouTube, make sure you click that like button. If you haven't subscribed, make sure you go ahead and subscribe and I'll see you next time.